In 1906 in New York City, the Warren family got sick with a disease called typhoid fever. Typhoid fever was a scary disease without a cure. First, a person would feel tired and feverish, and then they would have muscle aches, weight loss, rash, and a swollen abdomen. Quite often, typhoid fever would lead to death. A government worker came to the Warren home to investigate and see where the typhoid fever could have come from. As the worker investigated, he took notice of the cook, Mary Mullen. Mullen had worked as a cook for many families in the early 1900s, and each of them had contracted typhoid fever. It was soon realized that Mary Mullen was an asymptomatic carrier of typhoid fever. That meant that she had the disease all the time, but she never felt any symptoms of it. She was spreading the disease without even knowing it. Mullen was given the nickname Typhoid Mary. Doctors and scientists were very intrigued by Mullen and wanted to examine her, but she would always refuse. There was even an instance that she chased away doctors with a carving fork. Eventually, she was arrested and sent to a prison.